What is up guys? I'm G and welcome to another episode of Food Truck Foodies. Today we're here downtown at Roadrunner Grill. Why? To pay homage to the king. What king you ask? King Salami. So I hope you guys are hungry because we're about to enter a unique menu. Let's go check it out, shall we? What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Alright guys, so like always we have to go behind the doors and see with the owner and see what's going on. So today I'm here with Hector Sanchez. And how are you doing today Mr. Sanchez? I'm doing fantastic. So real quick for the people at home, what made you decide to get into the picture Uh Actually if it wouldn't have been for April Monterosa, I would never be standing in front of you right now. Of course, shout out to April. So, um, so she was just like the motivation for you to kind of go in? was actually the one pushing me off of the cliff with fear. <laughs> so yeah, without her, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I'd still probably be working another job. I'm working for someone instead of working for myself. Nice. So, um, for those who don't come, I know your menu is constantly changing, uh, but what would you say would be your best seller? Uh, best seller, I guess it's a tie, it'd probably be the brisket taco uh, and the uh, shrimp cocktail. Why do you think those are like your best items? I think people like the taste, which is most important in the food, uh, but they also like the, the, the heartiness of the meal. And uh, full disclosure, I have been here before, got here today, and their salsa is the bomb. So I hope you guys are ready to taste the bomb salsa when you come over. But a last question real quick that you um, get back to cooking here. What would you, uh, what is, do you have anything going on or anything big you want to uh, we're, we're pretty excited. We're waiting for football season to kick off. Uh, once that starts off, of course, we're going to support our road runners, our local home team. Uh, but at the same time, uh, football season is here, so we'll be adding more items to the menu. Uh, wings, hopefully tripas, muñecas, uh, a lot of different stuff coming up. Uh, just stay tuned. So, you know, now you can have that traditional home cook barbecue you used to have without actually having to put up with your family <laughs> so follow them on Facebook Instagram and find out when they're making all this delicious food so you can come out here and join them as well so enough of me talking time to get to the food all right guys so we got our food and I hope like I said I hope you guys are hungry because we got a lot to go with here so we're gonna start with the appetizers first so here we have the jalapeno poppers um, so they have bacon cream cheese cheddar cheese mix and jalapenos um, so and unlike regular ones, it's not just wrapped around, it's nice on top. Make it look all nice and pretty there. So, um, cheers. Whew! They're good. They're nice and creamy. You get the sharpness of the cheddar. And then right when you think you're done, you feel the kick. The kick comes. Of course, I love hot food, so it's not a big problem for me. But, um, jumping into the next ones here, I'm gonna jump into the Norteño Burger. So, this burger here, you have your patty, your mayo, your ham, which brings the Norteño part of it, uh, your cheese, avocado, I didn't get the avocado, but avocado's on there as well. And of course it comes with your side of fries. So, um, let's go. Ooh, and is this a cheese patty? Look at that beautifulness, there's cheese inside the patty. Pepper jack in there. Amazing. The ham goes with it really good. All the veggies, good taste. Now jumping into my favorite one. One of my personal favorite Mexican dishes, the torta. They got your ham, you got your cheese. Look at that beautiful one. Lettuce, tomatoes, onions, avocado as well. Of course I didn't get avocado either, but you can get an avocado as well. Served with fries, just like everything else. And I'm gonna go ahead and dip into this here. Crispiness and the butteriness of the bread combined with the ham and the flavors makes it a great ham torta. I'm not, I really haven't had a lot of ham tortas, but this is really, really good. I normally get a mix, but this is one of the best, I would say, ham sandwiches I've had, not even just torta, best ham sandwich I've had. 
I saved the best for last because why not? So I give you the brisket taco with the secret sauce. I know the ingredient that's in the secret sauce that I'm not gonna reveal to you guys. Just know it's what makes this salsa the best. Um, so I'm just gonna put some more on this other side here in a uh, nice slow motion for you guys. Of course, taco time. So full disclaimer, normally I don't like to eat before we shoot these videos. I like to keep everything a surprise or first original reaction. But I'm not gonna lie, I've had this before which is why I've came. Because the salsa is amazing and the brisket is amazing. And um, it's just bomb. Huh? Try it right here. Um, the menu is constantly changing because he doesn't like to keep everything boring and simple. So definitely be on the lookout on their Facebook, Instagram to make sure that you have um, the up-to-date menu to make sure you have what they have going because they constantly have different specials and different items and special items. Like this time that I came, they have the torta this time. Last time they didn't have it. So definitely check the menu, but everything is worth trying out. I've had the nachos before here when I was here. And the shrimp cocktail as well is one of the best shrimp cocktails in town. You get your money worth and I guarantee if you love shrimp, then you get a shrimp cocktail. So that being said, I'm gonna finish all this and we'll be right back after this. All right, whew, well I'm full. So uh, come check them out. They're at Roadrunner Grill on San Saba Street here right across from the Holiday Inn Express and the uh, College Cafe behind me. So definitely come check them out, uh, support them. They're, the guy has really good historical following restaurant wise um, and he's just doing it for fun. He loves it, this is what he does. Um, check them out during football season. This is going to be a Roadrunner tailgating spot, home and away games. Definitely come, he's talking about doing some wings, doing some uh, soups, some challenge burgers that I might have to come back and film. So definitely check that out. Follow their Facebook, Instagram, all that good stuff. And of course, like always, I'm G, the Food Truck General. So this is Food Truck Foodies. And remember, you can go to the streets.